Good afternoon viewers at home. Your hand to my with Dr. OG. In this video, we shall look at some tutorial questions on indices. So please kindly subscribe to my video channel after watching this video by just clicking the, uh, the subscribe uh, button below the video and the notification bell as well so that each time I upload a new video, you'll be informed. Thank you. Now, the example is solve the following equations. 4 raised to power x plus 1 is equal to 2 raised to power x minus 1 and 3 raised to power x is equal to 9 raised to power 2x plus 3 multiplied by 27 raised to power 1 minus 3x. Now the first one, 4 raised to power x plus 1 is equal to 2 raised to power x minus 1. If you look at the force at the, 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 the uh, uh, left and right side of the equation, you observe that we have a multiple of 2. 2 is, a, is, is common to the two of them. So we can write 4 in terms of multiple of 2 as 2 raised to power 2, which has uh, replaced 4, into bracket x plus 1, then uh, 2 raised to power x minus uh, 1. So all we need to do now is to expand the bracket in line with our uh, basic rules in indices. So we have what 2 raised to the power, then 2 multiplying by x plus 1, then it equals to 2 raised to the power x minus 1. So by the time we expand this, we have what 2 raised to the power 2x plus, because 2 times x is 2x, then 2 times plus 1 is 2, then it equals to 2 raised to the power x minus 1. So now, since 2 is common to the two sides of the equation, then we what? Cancel out the 2, and now equate 2x plus 1 to x minus 1. So by the time we equate this, the next thing is to collect like terms. So collect uh, like terms. So by the time you write collect like terms, what do you do? You have 2x minus x is equal to, because by the time plus s comes to the left hand side of the equation, it becomes minus x. It's equal to minus 1, then plus 2 going there becomes minus 2. So you have what? Uh, you now have what? x, because 2x minus x is x, is equal to minus uh, 3. So that is that uh, for the first uh, question. Now let's look at the second question. Let's look at the second question. Second question is 3 raised to power x is equal to 9 raised to power 2x plus 3 multiplied by 27 raised to power 1 minus uh, 3x. Okay. Now to do this Let's look at the two sides of the equation, both the left and the right hand side. We observe something that in the left hand side we have a, a multiple of 9 and 27, and that's 3. So since 3 can be can be factored from 9 and 27, that means we could look for the LCM in terms of uh, uh, LCM of 9 and 27 in terms of 3. So we have what? 3 raised by x here because what? So 9 can be expressed as 3 raised by 2, then multiply by power 2 x plus 3. Then uh, 27 can equally be expressed as uh, 3 raised to the power what, 3, that's 27, then to bracket 1 minus uh, 3 hex. Okay? So we have here what? 3 raised to the power hex is equal to, now we expand the bracket here, 3 into 2 into 2x two plus 3, then we are multiplying it with what? 3 into 3 into 1 minus uh, 3 hex. That is that. So we have what? 3 raised to the power x is equal to, Opening the bracket here, we have 3 raised to the power 2 times 2x, that's 4x, then plus 2 times plus 3, that's plus 6, multiplied by what? 3 into 3 times 1, that's 3, then 3 times minus 3x, that's minus 9x. So, you know, we are multiplying this by this. So, in that case, we now pick one of the integer 3 according to the law of uh, uh, indices. So, we now have what? 3 raised to the power x is equal to, we pick one 3, 3, then we add the powers together because we are multiplying them. And that whenever you are multiplying two index numbers and indices, you have the powers together. So 4x, you know, plus 6, plus 3, minus 9x. So these three will be cancelled because they are equal to each other, the powers will be equal to. So that what x is equal to 4x plus, because 6 plus 3 is 9, then minus 9x. Okay, collect like terms. x uh, is equal to, you can see 4x minus uh, 9x, that's what, minus 5x uh, plus 9. Okay, 
that's what x now bringing minus 5x here it becomes plus 5x is equals to 9 so you have what 6x is equals to 9 so how do we now get x we divide both side by 6 so we have x is equal to 9 all over 6 and something is common here 3 in 9 2 3 3 in the 6 that's 2 so x now because what 3 all over 2 or uh, 2 in 3 that's 1 remaining 1 all over 2 so that is a, that's about all that so don't forget to subscribe to my video channel by clicking the subscribe button below the video thank you and god bless you